Hello everyone, welcome back to the channel with me, Broly. Guess what guys, today we've hit 5k subs on YouTube, so we're doing a Q&A with Rose Goku Black. Say hello, evil Kakarot. Uh, 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 you know, whatever. Hello there, you inferior lowly mortals, this is Super Saiyan Rose Goku Black, and welcome to the Q&A. Hell yeah, let's get right into it and start with yes, our first question. For the record, I wasn't brought here against my will. I'm totally here because I simply feel like it. Mm -hmm. Lost Likely story. Broly dragged him in here, screaming. <laughs> I was not screaming. How dare you? Like a little worse. Just like Kakarot would. I was not. <laughs> ah, no, in all seriousness, though. Let's get to this. So, first off, from Freezy Pop and Mark, or Real Lord Frieza. Apparently, we're starting with this fourth question. Whatever. No, a statement. Show me the one. Dig it! Frieza! Oh, how dare you! Up. Ah! Always I with this know. shit. This no, guy. Okay. Moving right on. Second question. Did I know that there's a debate? Trunks might be my son. It's not a debate! It's true. Look at the eyes for all the proof. <laughs> what? Wait, eyes? But you don't have any. You, there's just two pale white, like, that's you don't have the, pupils. That's my point. He has one of my transformations. Oh, that's what that was. That little son of a Yeah. <laughs> even more so in Super, because he's got the sounds behind it, even. Yeah, that's right. Anyway. So wait, wait a minute. Does that mean you're related to Kale as well? Uh, not quite. It's a bit of a different setup. Different story. Mm -hmm. You show sure that, like, this is starting to sound an awful lot like a whole Luke Skywalker and Leia thing going on here. Now listen, there's nothing like that going on behind the scenes. Don't put ideas in people's heads. Okay, this okay. Guy. All right, moving on. Third question. What's your favorite thing about being a YouTuber so far? I think he means GodTube. But Rosé, I'll let you take this one first. Let's see, my favorite thing about being a god tuber. All the bitches! That, that, that's that been pretty nice. That, that, that has been very <laughs> nice. Why does this not surprise me? You are a salute, after all. I am not a salute! <laughs> you, know you know what? I'm going to ask my own question. Where the hell did you even come up with that? Oh, Every I don't know. Just one day, the idea hit Broly. Seemed like a good one, so we've been running with it. Really? I thought it was a speech impediment. <laughs> yeah, you would think that. Come on, you're supposed to be the learned one. Why resort to basic insults? Come on, Rosé. Thought you were okay. better than that. Okay, any who's. <laughs> What's the next question? Well, well, first I've got to answer this one. Let's see. Favorite thing about being a YouTuber? Well, mostly the love I get from the viewers and commenters, I guess. You know, before Broly started YouTube, he wasn't that much of a social person. So doing this and getting to interact with so many of you has helped Broly not only grow as a creator, but also as a person in general. You all inspire Broly to do better and be better every single day. And I can't thank all of you enough for that. Anyway, enough with the sentimental bullcrap. Let's move on. I know, no kidding. Anyways, but I mean, it's not like I can't agree. You, you know, it's been pretty fun. Anyways, um, let's see. Um, Okay, so second question. Do you know the way mother... F oh, son This of guy. He just can't let it go. No, he cannot. He cannot let the meme die! Uh, sadly, it'll never die. It fits into stuff way too easily. Cell tried to kill the meme and it still wouldn't die! It's still going, I know. Anyway, Krillin asks, is it okay to eat a burrito from the middle? What do you think? Uh, why would you do that? What are you, an animal? You obviously eat the burrito out of the end. You don't eat it through the middle. <laughs> what kind of animal are you? He's a rebel. Rebel, that's... Fight the system, Krillin. Down with the man. <laughs> oh my god, really? Yes, really indeed. All right, Rosé, would you ever consider making a collab with somebody who doesn't do just DB voices? Oh, actually, I already have. Um, I don't know if any of you have seen the videos, but I do. A co I did a couple collabs with a hostage. I mean, guess Waluigi. So yeah, I'd be doing. <laughs> oh. And I also did a co collab with Azuku Midoriya, so you can also check that out as well. 
So, to answer your question, yes, I would be willing to. Were they yes. fun? Yes, I suppose they were. <laughs> Good. Yeah, I suppose I, I wouldn't be uh, opposed to it either. Just depends on the person, I suppose. Indeed. We're not limited to just one series, guys. We can true. We can expand. We can grow. Let it us grow, true. damn it! <laughs> Seriously. All right. From Ed. From YouTube. Where are my testicles, Clarence? In your throat, where I left them. <laughs> Moving around. Oh, jeez. Oh, jeez. Frieza submitted a video. Oh, uh, no. You can already tell this is going to suck. You won't be able to hear this, Rosé. Give me a minute. I guess it's like 30 seconds long. Hello, okay, let's have a listen to this. I'm, I see the video. You, do you want to just click it at the same time? Oh my. Yeah, we can click it at the same time. That works. Okay, then. On the count of three. One, two, three. Hello, my brother. I am not your brother. You think because you have a 5K Q&A that you know the way. This but guy. But you do not know the way. You are a false idol. Uh, and I spit on you. Quick. Ah! Spit actually came out of the monitor! What the hell? The history of the existence. Yeah. Can you hear me being upset in the background? I spit on you. This guy. With all the spit. Well, that's pretty interesting. Always with the knuckles meme, this guy. False idol, huh? I don't know the way, eh? Look at that default jungle house picture. You couldn't even take time to get one that didn't have a word stamped all over the background. Good default, buddy. Get your red Ebola looking ass out of here. <laughs> uh, okay, Broly. Okay, okay. Easy then. You know what happens when you get too angry? You start powering up and then you start destroying everything. <sighs> I need a Snickers. Oh, uh, here you go. Uh, thank you. Mm, okay then. Delicious. All right. Is it okay to eat a pizza, starting from the crust, from Toru Lolly Dragon? Depends. Uh, Is it stuffed crust, as I guess Chi-Chi already said? Um, well, yeah, I suppose if it's stuffed crust, that's acceptable. Otherwise, though, no, absolutely not. No, 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 you don't eat the crust first. Well, I mean, what kind of savages are you? More rebels. They just want to fight against the system. Don't get down on them too much, Rosé. System. As I understand, it's all chaos and anarchy nowadays. <laughs> Pretty much. From Gurr, the Dragon Fister. Does Bruno Mars is gay? Well, from what I hear, Bruno Mars does gay has been the biggest in the media as of ten years ago. Or however that bit's supposed to go. Yes. The short answer. Yes. Uh, okay. I don't even... What? Does Bruno... Okay, first off, the grammar is just god-awful. No pun intended. Second... What the hell's a Bruno Mars and the... What's it matter about his sexual orientation? This is 2018, you idiots! <laughs> True. I think they're talking about Mars bars. It's a new kind of Mars what? bar that came out. Uh -huh. And they're delicious. Anyways, on to the right. next one, shall Again, we? from Gurr once more. What's the correct way to pronounce Kakarot? Well, um, K-A-K. R O U T Kakarot. <laughs> Wait, what? That, that that's not how you do it. It's pronounced Kakarot. No, Kakarot. Uh, uh, that's serious. Oh my god. Uh, yes. You, you know what? You, you know what? Let's just let's just move on. Let's <laughs> just move on. Oh, look at this from Megeka's art. Hello, Broly and Rose. First off, for Rose, I am absolutely in love with you. Oh, looks like you have a fan. You are powerful, <laughs> elegant, sleuty, and everything else. Here's a drawing that of didn't you. Say that. Second for bro. <laughs> sure it did. I'm interpreting. Uh, I don't care <laughs> for your interpretation. Uh, second for both Ro Broly and Rose. What are your favorite things and hobbies you like to do? Much love. Hmm. You go first. Yes. Well, first off, thank you very much, Mac Macaga. Is that how you pronounce it, Macaga? I, I think so. Yes, Something and like I. That. And anyways, I do love the illustration, by the way, Mechaga, and um, very honored and flattered to have you as a fan. And um, if you're doing anything later, just hit me up, and uh, I'll link the transmission over there. Don't we'll be too sleuty now. 
I am not <laughs> Okay, anyways, as for my favorite things and hobbies I like to do, um, killing Ningens is always a good time. You know, just flying above, overhead, some big cities or something. And always just a blast. Some blast. <laughs> oh yeah, definitely. You know, you know, and stabbing the Saiyans is always so much fun because they're always so surprised by it. You know, you think they'd expect it by now. Yeah, I bet you have stabbed a few Saiyans in your day, if you know what I mean. <laughs> uh, I am not engaging. I am not engaging. <laughs> I am not uh, engaging. And for Broly, pretty much video games and destruction. That wraps it up. What about destruction in video games? That seems like a help. Uh, I prefer the real thing. Okay, then. Moving on. Who's let's... All right. Yes. From Verqua Plays. Broly hates Goku. Does this also mean he hates Goku Black? Mm. Well, no, obviously, because I'm nothing like the actual Goku. He's an insufferable idiot with a big stupid grin on his face. Hell, he was so insufferable that after I stole his body from him, I immediately killed him and then killed his immediate area. I think Broly should be my biggest fan. Hmm. Well, I'm not gonna lie. I have to consider this option every time you come into view. Oh, gee. Well, is it better when I am uh, in my rosé form since that resembles no, Goku? No, then Lens? you just look like a sleut. I am... Ooh. <laughs> Damn it. Go Damn ahead, rosé. Do something about it. Well, I could if it wasn't for your stupid non-canon god form, quote unquote. Funny you call my form non-canon. <laughs> anyway, moving on. How much wood would a woodchuck chuck? Too much. Too much. Android 21. Hi. Just wanted to say you're amazing. Oh, well, thank you. Yes, oh. yes thank you very much. Hope that Wait, channel of yours goes well. <laughs> Question. Out of the both of you, who hates Goku and Kakarot? The most. Well, obviously me. That's oh, what, not even Emma, a question. I, I just. Oh yeah. Well, you know the difference between you and me, Broly. Yeah. What's that? One of us actually succeeded in killing him. <laughs> no. You almost didn't. got to do it. Almost got to do it twice in a row. When? When exactly did you succeed in killing him? When I stole his body. He was in his body all confused and stuff. I went up and stabbed him, and he fell over dead. I and didn't then I see killed it. It must family. not have happened. Uh, it did happen. Picks or it didn't happen, Rosé. Fine, I'll get the picks. Hold on. <laughs> ah, here they, here they are, see? Here's his body on the ground and stuff, and there's him writhing. I took, like, a, it's kind of like, you know, frame by frame, you know, because he's just kind of yeah. writhing. Then he Even I can use Photoshop, Rosé. Nice try. It's not Photoshop! <laughs> Looks to me like you killed Zamasu. It's... It's Goku! Look at what he... You know, I'm not even getting... I'm not... <laughs> let's just... Ah, man. I thought Zamasu was strong. Kakarot killed him so easily. Look at that. That is not... <laughs> ah, good stuff. I'm not, I'm not dealing with this. I am not dealing with this. But I still, I hate Kakarot way more. Uh, yeah, sure. Keep telling yourself that. Yeah, you're not the one who Remind flies into a rage every time he comes into view. No, you fly into a rage if you so much as hear a baby crying. We're not gonna get into that. Right. This guy. Anyway, this person. Uh, at G Z E Dong. Probably butchered that. I'm sorry. I think you look like you could be easily broken. <laughs> yes. That wait, is your answer. Question. What? Gold Zidong. Oh my, look at- wait, 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 wait a minute. I'm not falling for this again. I've been on VR chat too much. Is that a man or a woman? I don't know. Couldn't tell ya. Oh, damn it. Okay, anyways. Let's anyway, move on. we're getting pretty close to get through this, I think. Let's keep it up. From Cynthia right. Shaver. Goku oh, Black Rosé, for you. Why don't you go ahead and read it? Take it away. All right, then. What's your favorite character in Tekken? Mine's Jin Kazama. This unknown uh, Jin, my customized character, is saying hi to you. Oh, um, well, hello there, Cynthia Shaver. And, um, I don't really have a favorite character in Tekken because I really don't care for Tekken. Honestly, I was just playing the game because I thought people would like it. But, you know, then the views started going kaput and it's like, I'm not enjoying this game. Why the hell should I play it if no one's going to watch it? Good point. 
Very good point. Yes, and let's see. The next question is by a Fusamasu. What? Oh dear, mm. has there been more time travel shenanigans? Okay, for Super Saiyan Rose, Goku Black, can you figure out how to undo my fusion? Uh, why would you want to undo it? You're Fusamasu, you're all powerful. It's because you you're weak and mortal. That's why. <laughs> Oh, What's please. That? When I was Fuse Amasu, I made you, even in your precious god form, look like a helpless infant. I don't think so. I could smack your fused form around like it was nothing. Oh, I sincerely doubt that, good sir, considering how easily you got bested by Super Saiyan Blue Gogeta. Ah, uh, you must not know the facts. Gogeta wasn't a thing. You're talking no, about Goku. Goku and the... Uh, Fusion of the audience. Yes, Goku. He still right. slapped your. Well, yeah. If you broke the third wall and fused with actually real people, you would probably do the same. Not really. Mortals are weak and insignificant. I bet. I doubt any of them have a power level above five. Any one of those mortals has the power to grab an eraser and erase you from existence. Any one of them. Oh, so don't even start. Let's just move on to the next question. Yeah, that's right. Who's your favorite Pokemon? Machamp, of course. All the Mew. glorious muscles. <laughs> Mewtwo. He's boss. Not to mention, if Mewtwo wanted to, he could make your head explode if he so desired. He's also a fake poser. Excuse me? That's right. Mew came first. He's a shitty copycat. Whatever, he's far superior to Mew. Mew. Blech. No way. Not even. Whatever, let's just get on with it, shall we? <laughs> sure. Let's see. Is it okay to put a single red tile in a room with all white tiles? Red tile, white tiles. Hmm. Sounds no! like you're trying to cause problems. Seriously, why would you do that? Like, honestly, no! Absolutely you know, not! Just because of that, no head pats for you. None. Hmm. See, even an idiot like Broly knows that that's not good decorating. That's right. <laughs> what are you, crazy? Anyway, Sebastian Moon, question for both of us. What is our favorite Let's Play we've recorded since we started? And what's our favorite game we've ever been, John? I'll go ahead and let Rosé take this one first. Okay, I suppose my favorite Let's Play I've done so far would be the Xenoverse. That's been a pretty good time. Mm. And, you know, it's... You know, if you if it's something you watch consistently, you will that is like a series you can watch my growth as I work on the channel and stuff, you know, because that's kind of where I started. So I suppose I'm always going to have an attachment to that game, Xenoverse 2. Be sure to check it out. And um as for a game I'd like to binge, um Well, the minute Kingdom Hearts 3's release date is going to be announced, I'm going to start well, playing well, all the release date. What is that? <sighs> Didn't know Sorry, games got laced. <laughs> I'm sorry, I seem to be hanging around you for far too long. I'm trying to pick up your speech impediments. No, anyway. don't blame me. It's that Kakarot's brain. Yes, sometimes I wonder which of you two is the bigger idiot. Anywho's, hmm. the second that the Kingdom Hearts 3 game has a release date, I'm going to be playing and binging all of the Kingdom Hearts games. So, there you go. Well, sounds like a plan. And for me, it's not even really a let's play. My top 10s are the favorite thing I have on my channel. They don't get very many views compared to my other videos. But I always have a blast taking the 30 or 40 hours to write a whole script, collect and sift through footage, and crack a bunch of jokes. The last couple of them I did were even collabs with other DBTubers, which was fun. In fact, let me know in the comments below if y'all want to see those make a return. Anyway, okay, moving on. From uh, that emo gamer, Chunny Broly. Do you have any big YouTube projects planned for the future? Well, lots of stuff, including but not limited to lots more VR chats and skits and series like Bartender Broly, Bachelor Broly, as well as potentially chunny voice acted Let's Plays, and if I can afford it, some animations and parodies. We'll see. And then, I of course, for Rosé, take your question. Yes, but first I just want to point out that the whole doing skits and stuff with VR chat, that was my idea. I came, I, I thought of that. that, that was all me. I thought of that, so you're welcome. Not even close. Anyways. <clears throat> to dear Rosé, I noticed at the start of your videos that you call all us mortals a good amount of adjectives like filthy or disgusting. Is there some sort of weird fetish you have going on we don't know about? EXCUSE 
Fuck you! <laughs> Good sir! The salute has been outed not. once again. No! No! That is not how it is at all! I just find mortals lowly and disgusting because you're all a bunch of warmongering miscreants! Mm hmm. Sure. Likely story, Rose. <sighs> anyway, from Tentacle Fun Time. Is that your tail you have wrapped around your waist? Or are you another form of legend? Yes, it is a tail, in fact. Good of you for noticing. Let's keep on speeding through these. Oh, Tenko. that's what that smell was. Hey, don't you, don't you bitch about my tail, or I'll smack you with it. Try that and I'll grab it and I'll make you cry like a bitch on your own video. Oh, unlike Raditz, I'm not weak like that. Anyway, you must have forgotten. Know. We tend to train against that exact bullshit. Yes. That's right. Yeah, Didn't work against Vegeta. Sure as hell it could work on me. Whatever you say. Anyways, um, next question by Zion Melvin. To Black and Broly, what would it be like if the both of you achieved Ultra Instinct? Well, if I achieved Ultra Instinct, it would be game over. I would just be able to eradicate every single mortal in the universe, all the gods, Zeno, the Grand Priest, they'd all be done. I would have an empty, peaceful, quiet universe, and people would stop making damn noise! Yeah, first thing Broly would do is go and ally with the Daishinkan, and then make everybody pay. <laughs> ally with the... I doubt the Grand Priest would lower himself to allying himself with the likes of you, and why would he be interested in allying with you? Isn't he considered oh, a good guy? Does. No, he's evil. He's 100% evil. Broly ain't um, buying into that goody two shoes stick. Wait a minute! You're the one who's been posting on GodTube those stupid conspiracies! Oh, they had conspiracies, my friend. He's evil. Don't you doubt it. Oh, for God's sake. Then again, why didn't he stop me in the future? I mean, I was killing gods, I was ripping everything yeah, apart. Yeah, because you were helping his plan. Okay, anyways. <clears throat> Thomas Minton asks, would you ever consider doing a collab with somebody who does- oh wait. We already did that. What are you even reading? Whoops. This I guy. Bet. Does Bruno Mars is gay from present Goku? Screw you, Kekarot! Moving right on. From Gamer2K01. Black, why did you not steal Vegeta's body? Um, because I didn't want to be five foot nothing. Not to mention <laughs> the troll doll hair and the McDonald's logo on his forehead. Oh, not to mention, he always loses! <laughs> I don't care if he got his one moment of glory in the recent episodes of Super, we all know he's gonna get his shit stomped in the next one! It's true. It's very, very Daddy true. Toriyama do Daddy Toriyama doesn't love you, Vegeta. Accept it! <laughs> no kidding. He's never gonna get his true recognition. Alright. From Toru- No! Yes, no, whatever. Whatever answer you want, Toru. You got it. Anyway. Cam Monster, to Broly, what are my thoughts on Bio Bro- What is this Bio thing you speak of? Sounds disappointing. Wait, are you trying to say that Broly smells? You're on thin ice, Cam Monster. Thin ice. And to Rose, how do you feel about some people calling you Blackarot? Uh, hmm, Blackarot. Kinda has a nice ring to it, I suppose. And I suppose it's not inaccurate. Um. Then again, though, I can't help but fear if I said Blacker out around Broly, he might end up getting slightly triggered. Ah, 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 uh, yep, there we go. There we uh, go. Okay, anyway. Watch yourself. Oh, by, the, by the way, Broly, it's pronounced Bio Broly. I don't know if you knew this or not. Bio Broly. Can the you not read? Uh, for God's sake. Anyways, the, the filthy mortals actually made a clone of you. Can you believe Wait, that? What? A clone of Broly? <laughs> They couldn't yeah, possibly. Uh, oh, no, they did. They they did. They did. And uh, it was horrible. It was horrible. It, because it it got beaten by Goten and Trunks. Kid no Trunks. wonder. Just, Fake Broly. But yeah, just... Yeah. You might want to do something about that. That could be damaging to your reputation. Mm. Broly's on it. All right. From what you expect, looks like the final question. What convinced you to do YouTube? Rosé. Why don't you go first? Oh, well, you know, you know, I was just chilling on GodTube and stuff. Then all of a sudden I see this crack lizard, um, hashtag crack lizard in the comments, by the way, please and thank you. Lord Freezer going about, you know, going, oh, and oh, and, you know, you know, and then I see this guy, um, 
demon Artemis, or devil Artemis, whatever, you know, going, ah, turns gay! And then, you know, I just see all this shit, and I'm like, well, if these inferior mortals can do it and get decent followings, I'm a god, so therefore, anything I do will be infinitely superior to them. So, uh, yeah, that that's how it, that's how it started. God, how far up your own ass are you? About as far as you are up yours, buddy. Well, that's pretty fair. That's pretty fair. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> all right. And uh, I'm actually going to break character here to answer this one personally. Because uh, the Broly voice is starting to actually kill my throat going for a straight solid 30 minutes. <laughs> <laughs> but uh, uh, what convinced me to do YouTube? Honestly, it was just uh, watching people like the Game Grumps, uh, PewDiePie, AVGN, and a whole bunch of other people. Uh, just kind of like watching them on like a daily basis and realizing that they always like brighten my day up whether I'm feeling bad or... Even if I'm not feeling too bad, they always make it better somehow. I kind of want to do, uh, be able to bring that same feeling to other people, you know, because I, I like making people feel good and this and that. So if I can make even one person laugh a day, then I consider it a win, right? So that's pretty much why I got it. Yeah, in all seriousness, I'm going to break character too, but in all seriousness, um, it was because of people like Mark and Gurr and uh, yeah. Devil Artemis and stuff that I got inspired to do this too. Um, I had no idea it would... I would end up where I am. Like, you know, I thought I'd be lucky to get like a thousand subs and it's just like, here I am now and it's like, holy shit. So a big thank you to you guys. And yeah, I look seriously. forward to seeing, uh, you know, I look forward to having Chun grow along with us and stuff. And Hell just, yeah. Uh, yeah, I definitely want to give a big shout out to uh, to Koi here, not only for coming on the Q&A, but also being super supportive throughout all of my growth and stuff. And the same goes out to Mark and and uh uh Gurr, CL, uh freaking shiny i'm probably gonna miss a whole bunch of people tom weiss you know um if i didn't say your name it's because we're trying to crunch for time here but everybody who i work with who i hang out with and stuff like that you guys always and even all you viewers and stuff out there you always inspire me to do better and to you know keep working keep the grind up and keep making cool stuff trying new things and all this and all that so <laughs> Heck yeah. Oh, and by the way, if CL is watching, um, you know what? Here's a little gift for you, CL. Hashtag smelly bitch in the comments, please, and thank you. <laughs> ah, she'll never escape it. <laughs> all right, seriously, though, all, uh, guys, thank you so much for all the support and the good feels you've been giving me and the channel these past few months. I mean, we hit 5K insanely quick, insanely quick, thanks to all the boostage from everybody else and you guys, you know, probably liking and sharing my stuff uh, so much. I can't thank you enough. I know you guys will help push me to 10K, even further beyond eventually. Like, I'm super excited, guys, to be going on this journey with y'all and whatnot. I look forward to growing with you guys, uh, not just as the channel, but also as a community. Maybe we can actually make an impact on the world one day, you know, like some of the other uh, big name people could uh, could do and do do, like, all the fucking time. Uh, if I could ask just one favor of all you peeps who are actually watching this uh, 5K video right now, if you could go back and find whatever video it was that made you want to sub to the channel and share it somewhere whether it's facebook twitter or uh pinterest wherever it is that you share stuff shares help a hell of a lot um and even if like 10 percent of the people that watch this video did that it would drastically help our growth drastically help our like notoriety and whatnot out in the world so uh if you could i would be super super happy and as always guys thank you for watching don't forget to take care of each other and we'll see you all in the next video take care everybody Yes. Now go there, you little peons. Your legendary Super Saiyan has commanded you. Go! <laughs> we'll see you in the next one, guys. Take care.